It gives me great pleasure at this time to announce that the Board of Trustees of State Institutions of Higher Learning has voted unanimously to name Dr. Dan Jones as the 16th Chancellor of the University of Mississippi. With that announcement, Dr. Dan Jones was selected as the next Chancellor of the University of Mississippi. Let me say with, uh, with gratitude and with joy, uh, I am pleased to accept the position of Chancellor of the University of Mississippi. I love Mississippi and I love Ole Miss. And for someone with those affections, there's no higher privilege, honor, or responsibility than serving as this university's chancellor. Prior to the announcement, Jones fielded questions from alumni, faculty, staff, students, and community leaders in interview sessions throughout the day. And I think from, especially as my role as alumni president, you know, the one thing I heard from alums over and over again is we want somebody who understands our cultures, who understands the challenges that Ole Miss has and the uh, opportunities. And the first thing he said is this is a great American public university and we can be even greater. And I think that all the alums you can see, <laughs> you know, again, we wanted someone who understood us, um, who understood the culture, who understood our traditions, who understood the opportunities and challenges, and he is the right person for the job. Jones follows the 14-year tenure of Robert Kyatt, whose service as chancellor led Ole Miss to a renaissance and national recognition in hosting the first presidential debate in 2008. I think that uh, we're truly blessed to have Dr. Jones serve as our chancellor. I commend the college board for its thorough selection process and screening of candidates, and I truly believe we've selected the very best person to serve as chancellor of university. He's smart, he's capable, he's experienced, he's compassionate, uh, all those people are going to love having Dan Jones as chancellor. So we work from a strong base of achievement, but there's much ahead of us to be accomplished. We must not be satisfied. None of us in the Ole Miss family, as long as Mississippi ranks near the last of any list, we must not be satisfied with any accomplishment of this university. We are the flagship liberal arts university of this great state of Mississippi, and we have a large responsibility to see that not only are we successful as a university, but that our entire state benefits from our work. Jones begins his first official day as chancellor on July 1st.